How's about we go and blow up an alien facility? Let us go and destroy it. Setting course for the Australian sector. I do want to grab the other scientist, possibly. And depending on if we have a sniper or not, I'm well, I'm probably gonna buy the Reaper upgrade. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, no. No, this is not a team. Like, I don't know why you decide to make these teams. No. I like what you're offering. But right now, I've got a need, and that need can only be satisfied by a Reaper. And... Who are you bound with? You're with DeLuca. I love you, but I'm not taking you. Instead, we are going to take... Fluffy, and that's about what we've got set up team-wise. I need to make my weapons available. Uh, utility items available. Weapons available. Armor available is irrelevant. Now, first things first, our Reaper friend. I'm going to purchase tactical rigging. Yes, it'll take 11 from the pool, but I kind of want you to have an item that you can make use of. And that item is... will give you... Hmm. We'll give you a stasis vest. And instead of your normal rifle, we're going to give you the plasma rifle. For the Reaper just because I think that'd be an amusing item to make use of. Now, has it actually changed from the Technic Rifle? Yes, the Shadow Lance. With a nice little damage boost on top of everything. Right. So, you're equipped for war. War, war, what is it good for? And you are probably going to take the Katana. You're not going to take the katana. The katana is going to go to the person with heavy armor. Because if we need to kill something, we are going to kill something with the katana. I still haven't gotten the fusion swords. Excuse me. Let me fix that problem. Because I'm apparently an absolute moron. There we go. Now you've got a decent sword equipped. Loadout. You're also going to get a war suit. You'll take the Shredder Gun. And instead of the grenade, you're gonna take... Blue Screened... and Arashi. We have no snipers on us. Everything else is fairly decently equipped. You've got almost all your stuff. Uh, is there something I'd like to put on you, weapon upgrade-wise? Well, I'm going to give you the dodge PCS, because you're going to be more of a tank than anything else. Weapon upgrades. Take a superior autoloader, because we always give a superior autoloader to someone. Oh, never mind. You're already equipped. Whoops. Hmm. You're already equipped. I think DeLuca is also max equipped. DeLuca is not max equipped. You're going to get a... Adv uh, superior no. Advanced extended mag. Superior hairline trigger, so we have a chance to fire again. Also gonna customize you, because we haven't had anyone who actually does this stuff. And keep the attitude of hard luck. We're gonna make use of a new voice. Alright, Miss Harley, welcome. Now DeLuca looks at now DeLuca will sound absolutely livid whenever we do anything. But aside from that, I think we're all decently equipped. Let's go, hopefully, and murder some folk. And trust me, if an alien ruler shows up on this mission, 
even if it would hurt me, I'm going to still reveal our Reaper and kill the ruler In position immediately. For deployment. It's one of the nice things about the Reaper is the Reaper has the best chances of just straight up murdering a ruler whenever the Reaper does anything. I don't think there's anyone who could even show up at this base aside from a ruler. Yeah. We are moving to take out a high security advent installation operating out of this region. Intel from the Resistance suggests this facility is conducting research critical to the Avatar project. Once in position, approach the designated target and plant the X4 charges. Once they're armed, move to minimum safe distance and level that facility. There are only three ruler types, but I'm just saying that one can Minus always one show up again. Target coordinates are locked in. Move to designated position and place the X4 charges. Squad concealment active. All right, Reaper. Ah, the game already knows who I would yell at them if they didn't give me immediately. Tell me. They have a patrol moving here. I will always find you. Hmm. Let's just run you over here and reveal anyone. Okay, there's no one to reveal otherwise, so let's just move Roger everybody that. in to get ready. I already killed one, yes, I'm just saying. There's still two more that can show up. I don't think they can both show up, but you never know. Fluffy, fluffy, fluffy. What, I, what will I do with you? You, can, do. you all can just get together in cover. That's basically what we're doing here. Quit nagging! <laughs> right, I also need to send the spark on another mission, but I need to upgrade the spark before I send it on to another Roger mission, that. which is the primary reason why I haven't sent the spark on any missions. We're just gonna hope we can make this quick. DeLuca being so outrageously- what? Okay, this is gonna be a lot harder than I thought. Is there a door? There is a door in. Moving as ordered. The target is marked. There's a gatekeeper. Yeah, there's a doorway inside. I would break through the door, but that's a horrible I decision. So we're just gonna sit here first, because we're gonna need to spend a few turns trying to escape. Um, let's see. I want to get as close as physically possible. Fair enough. I want to get my people as move. close as possible to the entrance. If they're close enough, then we could just probably do an Let's instant do exfil basically immediately. And that's basically my current strategy, is just keep everyone lined up, gun line style. If we get discovered, just murder everything Solid copy. upon doing so. Let the Reaper do her work, get through the facility, trigger the explosives, and then run. First things first, let's open the door. Yes. Menace 1-5, you're near the target position. Now... What the hell? That's new. Oh, you are one away from being able to get there, my fair lady. So let's I dash around. Those appear to be some sort of incubation chambers. No doubt part of this system to keep Advent well supplied with reinforcements. When it comes to the aliens, it's always one big experiment. Yeah, so as of right now, since there is no one over here, we're just going to move up to the facility entrance, and we're probably going to just exfil Let's do this. the, like, next turn. There'll be no casualties. We'll always be in cover. Let's do this. No one will be able to respond to shoot at us. It is sad that we're not going to get anything else out of this mission. Get it done. Other than an immediate exfil, but you know what? It's just funny enough as is. Rolling 
They're just all stacked up in a line. This is the hunter's, like, this would be the hunter's shtick. All right, so plant the X4. It always reveals. And then you just get to sprint. Menace one five, status confirmed. X4 charges are armed. Move to the extraction point for immediate evac. We'll plot the extraction point down there. This will reveal the gatekeepers and have them take action. Whoa. Oh, wait a minute. Will we reveal them? Oh, no, it doesn't tell us. On my way. If you, oh, you revealed. Makes me sad. I should have done this beforehand. But then again, I didn't know how it would react. Well, you know what? Because we can all take the shots anyway, we might as well take the shots against the gatekeeper. Which procs rupture. And you can leave. Just in time. We'll just kill a gatekeeper and then just run. I guess that'll be okay. There's no reason not to, and it's just too funny not to. Now, if they dropped any loot. I got it, right? Right, because I can also gain uh, ability go. points from doing this. You know what? There actually is a reason for me doing all these shenanigans. Spitfire, would you be able to see anything? Of course not. Uh, if I were to launch, not a frost bomb, if I were to launch just a regular old frag. Fistful of frags, if you will. Get ready for some boom boom! It doesn't, the mod doesn't really fit that well. So that reveals the next one. Did I move our other heavy away? I think I did, like an idiot. I did. Oh uh, well. Oh uh, yeah, you can evac. Since I moved Fluffy, even if he did drop loot, I wouldn't be able to take it immediately. Sigh. Finally. I mean, at least we can get some free kills. That's like basically the main thing behind this. I mean, at least we can get free kills. How many is that now? Okay, I'm not punished for this. I'm gone. I was about to make a really dumb comment, because sometimes I have these really weird thoughts of like, ooh, it'd be cool if this would happen, ooh, it'd be cool if this would happen, ooh, no time to spare. what would happen if these specific setups occur? But when I think about them afterwards, I realize that I'm, I'm actually home. a moron, For now. because the most recent intrusive thought that just came into my psyche I can handle that. was a thought that said, oh, you know what would be awesome? What would happen? If we had six, if target. we had, what would the score screen look like if we had killed a Xeno in one turn and that was all that it took to end? After looking at it, Ready I realized, wait a minute. You just have a one to one kill ratio, that's about it. Menace one five, status confirmed. Four charges contained. Oh, there are only six Xenos on the entire mission. Perfect. Flawless, some ability points gained. I don't know what they're used for, they're actually pretty helpful. According to Advent officials, and now I just get to recent run. attacks by dissident elements operating outside of the city centers have done little to slow the progress of Advent's ongoing development or outreach programs. Voluntary citizen emigration. I can't wait numbers till the propaganda are announcers reportedly... are silenced. Well done, Commander. It's always good for morale when we ace a mission like that. I could probably send them out on a mission once again. With Perfect. the alien facility destroyed, their efforts to develop the Avatar project will likely suffer a substantial decline, at least for the time being. Excellent work, Commander. All right, you're in sustained training for six more days. Um. 
thought there was... Oh, no, because someone else has the negative of, like, oh, my gosh, fear of being wounded. <sighs> well, the Avatar Project gets dropped. We don't know of many other facilities, but it's good enough. Really? Really. Hmm. Spectre, Heavy Mech, and Codex. I mean, sure. I agree we still need to cleanse the, the Chosen. US it's just we're precinct. kind of in the middle of doing other things right now. Because as long as the Avatar Project doesn't go to full, we're basically in a winning position. Let's see what we can get off of this mission. Hopefully we can actually get more supplies. Alright, well, I'm sorry I would love to have you in here, but I'm going to take you two out. Gonna remove you guys, because I want a decent team set up. Make armor available, make weapons available, make utility items available. Now, Rage and Cajun, and Abco, because we need our sharpshooters. Oh, you can get weapon upgrades on your main gun. Wait a minute, no, you have a main gun, that's not true. I should upgrade Zalroko the Roboto. But it's also expensive. The katana? Oh my gosh, wait, the katana deals more? I'm surprised that that counts as a beam weapon, but Jesus. It's the fact that they can't bond with anything that makes it a problem. Give me a blaster launcher, too. As opposed to a frag grenade, uh, let's toss in, you know what, um her talent rounds to try to make use of your glorious ability. Uh, you're good. Abco, you're gonna take up the mantle of blue screens, and we're going to build another item that we've been much waiting for, the Plasma Lance in and of itself. We'll get the Spark upgrade, and we'll get the upgraded armor for the Spark. Now, I would really, really love to use the spark, but I don't ha- I only want bonded soldiers. I just put them away, I know, but we'll take the full bond. Or the full Monty, the full team, if you will. But Zalroko is upgraded, and I promise I will do my best to make use of Zalroko in the future. War, war, what is it good for? Frag into acid. And the war suit's rocket launcher will instead turn into the shredder gun. You're good. You've got the frost grenade. And is there anything else that I really want to give? Raging in a Cajun... Did I give you your full soldier abilities? Excuse me. Excuse me. I don't think you understand what I want to put you through. Ah, well, fine. We've got a decent mix. Decent spread across the board. And I think all of these people are well and ready to go steal some supplies. Why would I give you a grenade? On second thought, Tracer Rounds would be better, wouldn't it? Because AP Rounds don't deal additional damage. Dragon Rounds... Oh, they do deal extra damage. Venom Rounds, too. No, we're against robots. So... AP Rounds actually make more sense on you. If we're trying to do some kills. Alright, I think we're good. I'm fairly certain we can take these on. And we'll get some unbonded soldiers. I'll send Zyrko on another mission. Menace, ready to deploy. Hopefully just a milk run mission. Anyway, there's like, what, seven units here? It's not enough for me to really concern myself with that much. Which means they're probably going to shove in an alien ruler. Just to spite me in North America. Or the uh, Warlock will show up, and that'll be just fun dealing with a regenerating Chosen. I don't think I'm actually well designed to fight Local him at all. Local resistance operatives have managed to shut down an advent train that was passing through this area. Oh. As of yet, the aliens haven't managed to secure the location. 
so we're moving in to take advantage. Neutralize any hostile contacts in the AO. Secure the site and lock down whatever cargo you can find. Menace 1-5, coordinates of the advent train are locked in. Move to secure. I Eliminate mean... all hostiles. We've confirmed our previous readings, Commander. Be on alert for robotic enemies moving near that position. I mean... Say what you will. I really, really hope that that explicit event does not happen. Because I know it can. It very much can. I just hope it doesn't. I have a Reaper, right? I do have a Reaper. I have the Reaper I'm with the most you. mobility you in the flipping sight. world. There's an alien patrol nearby. Oh, Jesus. They're all right there. Well, Lewis, I sent you in the exact wrong direction. Choi, can you make a joy and get over here? So, there are codexes and there are specters. What does the hack look like? It'd be a haywire protocol on the heavy turret. I would take control over the turret, but it would probably supercharge the turret instead. Or not, it would be perfectly fine, and I'm just very, very scared of what might happen. Well, the turret shut down anyway. I've got access. So we're not going to have to worry about that for a while. Uh, Abco, Abco, uh, Abco. So... You'll be allowed to see a bunch of things. You just need to get up here first. Because I kind of want to see what's available on a uh, inglorious Overwatch. Now, Chloe, I, I know that I made you go in that direction before, but I've is got some slight differences to make. And Abco, what do I want to do with you? You know what? An outflank is not a horrible decision to make, really. Let's go and twice. do it. And okay, it's it's cannon fodder. It's there's not a lot you really need to explain to cannon fodder. It's get him to heavy cover where he's not going to be re where she's not going to be revealed, and then when the time comes, just to destroy them. Deluca, Deluca, delicious. You can move around this corner. I'll see about that. All right, Lewis. Um, you can move towards the train. It's like, what do I really have I'm you do, move. Mr. Thompson? Oh, you're a random resistance soldier. I didn't even realize. Huh? No, 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 no. Okay. The green bar is their will. As soldiers fight and as the mission drags on, it will slowly drop. As negative events happen, it will slowly drop. Generally, as anything happens, something will drop. Yeah, I'm procking That's cereal. For me. So, this codex is gonna die. No dodges for you. But yeah, basically their will will slowly be drained as time goes on. And eventually, eventually, you're going to have to send them off mission to restore it by taking time. You're going closer to our sniper. That's technically safer. Technically. But only on the barest technicality. Hello, Codex. We've got a lot of dear friends for you to meet. Hmm, that actually is a very, very poor situation to be in. Well, Mech 1, we ignore most of your armor anyway, and can just straight up kill you, so let's go and do so. Wait, you're not dead? <sighs> this makes this a lot more difficult. It makes it more difficult than it has any right to be. Oh, oh my gosh, Fluffy. Fluffy outflank. What's over there?
Deal enough damage to the codex to make it not able to do anything else. Fluffy! Now is not the time! I have sight beyond vision. Alright. Well... There's not a whole lot we have to worry about. So that one... okay. At this point we're just gonna change focus. We're just gonna make it so we can do a really massive turn. Involving... Uh, do I want frost bomb? No, I want to shoot you in particular. Now let's dual strike you. Lewis, I didn't even way. realize you weren't a soldier of ours. Like Jesus, man. Your hair could use some work. That but tough. we welcome you anyway to the resistance. Now. If only you had cereal. I mean, I can't dual strike, but. So, the current plan is a Ragin and a Cajun is going to begin cutting some people down with a Reaper. I'll make it clean. Because you failed with cereal to kill your target, which is very irritating. So that'll give you the target momentum eliminated. and free move. Which means we can move on over. What do I go for the other robot? It's an other robot. Okay, we can't kill that one. But we can definitely kill the Codex, at least. X-ray neutralized. Hmm. We'll dual strike the current mech instead. Shred's armor forces you to fire again. Maybe uh, if the shot... No, because I think it's every kill that's made. I think that actually counts for serial. So he might get, get an close. action back. Do you get an action back for that? No, that's disappointing. More depressing, really. You're out of actions, so the Codex is going to get an action, unfortunately. Despite my best efforts, the Codex gets to take a turn. Or not. Choi, just Step grab the loop. Two Illyrium cores, perfect. I got your stuff here. That's what I was kind of waiting for. You have a 100% chance to hit, kill the Codex. <laughs> AP rounds plus Blood Trail. With no chance of revealing. Oh, hello. I was waiting for you. You have been judged. Now it's you don't generate shielding, defense increased after the first attack of each turn. Shotgun can summon advent stun lancers. Brutal attacks decrease will of any soldiers fighting. Adversary Templars increase damage from explosives. And I am your punishment. This is the first time we'll get to fight. The Chosen aren't going to make this easy for us. Keep your heads down and press forward. We need to get to their location to take them out. Hello, robots. I'm not a big fan of seeing you. That would be the case, it's just we have to get to him right now. And so far we're being impeded by a bunch of robots that I'd really rather not deal with at this point in time. Tactical analysis, the super heavy turrets no longer shut down, but can't perform any actions. If you say so. No! Why did you move? I was gonna say, why don't you have any weapon upgrades? But apparently weapon upgrades are eaten between, like, sets. <sighs> well, it's not like you were useful anyway during this time, so we're just gonna have to fight these things normally. Let's do this! Are they close enough for capacitor discharge to actually be useful? Yes, they are. It deals double damage to robotics. 
So, capacitor discharge doesn't destroy loot, so we're just going to... We'll keep Rage in... Okay, we're going to send Rage in a cage in to activate the Chosen order. normally. And in fact, you know what? We're going to conceal you. Because I want to find Head the Chosen. Deluca. Who can you give additional actions to? The wrong person. Maybe the right person, depending. Okay. How far can you lob a grenade? Can you lob it far enough to go and shred their armor? Of course not. You are not close enough to do anything valuable. <sighs> Fine, I'll rely on the capacitor discharge. Freaking dumb movements. You'll pick up the pieces, because the super heavy turret I'm not that concerned with. Ah, the AP rounds might also be useful. So, we're going to start off with the capacitor discharge like I'd originally planned. Where is it? Hitting both Hit of you. Everything. That was fast. We can probably shoot either of these and we'll be successful in killing them either way. Oh, never mind. Okay, you took near max, and your shots ignore armor, so we can just spend your turn killing this one. You won't be revealed, because no one should be able to reveal you whenever you succeed. Only furthers the need for my presence here. Fluffy will probably give an extra action okay, to our Reaper, so our Reaper can just take another shot. We will overcome. Which means you can fire again, meaning we're probably going to spend two of our shots on getting rid of you. It hit the plate! And then we'll finish off the mech. This will also start building up our crit chance. I cannot hunt without bullets. Spitfire, uh, we'll advance teamwork here. And we'll see if you can kill off the turret. Just to buy our new rookie some support. Are you dead? You aren't dead yet. You aren't dead, rookie. Who are you raising? Random zombies. Really? Fine. You know what? Let them come to you. Let them see what Blade Storm does. Target neutralized. <sighs> Don't have any more Blade Storms available. That's fine. I'm just very annoyed once again. That... Okay, there we go. Looks like we're gonna have to send the whole house to go deal with the Hostile target down. annoyance that is. The Warlock. Spectral Rupture? What? Oh, I'm guessing that's a self-destruct. Hmm. Do I care about them self-destructing? Not really. I could probably just run away and still be perfectly fine, to be honest. Firing against the Heavy Mech is not that great. Sniper mans, I really wish your cereal on the first turn was not wasted. Can you just dead eye and like kill it? Guaranteed. I really wish your first shot was not so much of a failure. The death of these subordinates will prevent nothing. What's over that? Oh, 
Oh no, all your weapon upgrades are gone because they were all on the previous weapons. <sighs> Give me time to reload. I'll be glad once we have the interchangeable weapon upgrades. Because please, I would like one. I'd like to be able to use them again. I was not aware about that case when it involved <laughs> it. So what's the other one you can see? Oh, you can see that spectral zombie. Well, kill this one, please. Ah, DeLuca is now a major. Wait, DeLuca wasn't a major? Since I guess when? Okay. okay, fine. What? Oh, right. There's nothing here. Let's see if Fluffy can find something. <laughs> well, Fluffy finds a gun turret. Not too horrible of a gun turret, mind you. I can still make use of it. Uh... No, after I kill something, I get a free movement, so I might as well just sh Hostile terminated. Right, that would have been scary if that had succeeded. So I think you're further than this, but to be safe, I'm Medic just going to move position. you to this heavy cover here. Just do not reveal said chosen. Shred, you do not have shred. Can you see the turret? You can only see it if you're like right here. Let's move already. So There's not much of a move up, but you know, just killing a turret seems like a brilliant idea right now. And you agree Let's wholeheartedly. Alright, you reloaded. God, this makes banish so much worse. This doesn't have the repeater, so I can't do the instant kill shenanigans. Makes me so mad. I'm all over it. Alright, well here comes the Chosen's action, which is probably Burn seven more dudes. Sacrifice you for the Elder's blessings. Well, Abco, you are available to take the shot whenever. So let's see how close we can get to the move. warlock. at? Right. You're even further. <sighs> if I don't use run and gun, I'm going to use run and gun now. Going in for the kill. It's the only way I can guarantee that I might be I'm able to it. see the warlock. Because I was going to reveal him this turn anyway. The elders have chosen me. Just as they have chosen you, Commander. We are both destined to serve at their side. To bring their vision to this world and beyond. Come, allow yourself to be reclaimed. That's the Elder's Warlock. All reports indicate he's nearly as dangerous as they are when it comes to psionic capabilities. So low profile happens. What I'm expecting though, you can take a shot. Admittedly, it's a really bad shot. But you can try to do so, unless we want to do advanced teamwork instead. I'm trying to melee you. No, I'll take the 25%. Jesus! A clever ploy, Commander. Oh, the explosive didn't count. <laughs> Well, thank you. I was surprised you crit from all the way across there. You see, Abko's reliable. Waka isn't. Right now, at least. We're gonna have Klo move up, because Klo at least can try to do banished shenanigans later, once we're actually, you know, caught up to that location. There's some case to be made of simply sending giving Klo the extra movement speed to catch her up there faster, but you know what? I couldn't care less. Affirmative. Moving out. Thompson. <laughs> Good luck being useful. Can you, like, loot the container? No, I can't have the new guy just be a uh, looter. And that's disappointing. Ah, 
Someone has watched the stream once or twice. Oh my gosh, you saw stun lancers. Please, send them to me. Yes, yes, run to my face. Run to my face. No. No running to my face. You disappoint me. Quit summoning stuff and fight me, you coward. Right, this is what you do. There we go. Bladestorm 1. Doesn't kill. They have just enough health to survive. Abko has watched it once or twice. There we go. One down. They're being really aggressive with those lancers. X-ray neutralized. The loss of these subordinates is as meaningless to me as it is to you. Send me your fledgling warriors, Commander. I am God. ready to absolve them. Well, fine. Gotta move up. Gotta move that well, gear up. We'll have one more turn before Serial can activate again. But I'm hoping that Serial, combined with us actually, you know, being moved up here, means we'll be able to do something about this stuff. Now, considering the sheer number of stun lancers, I'm going to I just move her up here me. and just give him a little friendly snipe at this one to finish it off. For no reveal for here. Child of the elders. Humanity will repay a tally in flesh! Probably gonna use advanced teamwork soon. Probably. Not entirely certain. I mean, it does kind of work. Heading out. So we're gonna move you here. I can either try to stab you, which can kill you, or I can try to shoot you, which... The stabbing technically is a better chance of killing you, so might as well. Alright, that's down. We have one more spectral duder to deal Target with. Target eliminated. Defile! The weapons of the chosen are sacred objects! I didn't check to see if you had Reaper available. Did you have Reaper available this whole time? No, you have one more turn before you can do Reaper shenanigans. Actually, speaking of which, I think Abko's last time he was on stream was, uh... Two XCOM streams ago? Dropped in to say hello. DeLuca can move in. Uh, let's see here. Thomas, or Thompson. Oh, that'd be so funny if I get the newbie to get a uh, free kill on the Chosen. That'd be hilarious. Especially at one health. Choi, Choi, Choi. Well, Choi, I'm actually going to move you just up. Here I come. You're not going to go that much further because I want you to aid protocol our good Ragin' in the Cajun Man so we can take an Overwatch shot. This should give him an Overwatch shot to make use of. And Fluffy, you just move up to some form of heavy cover. Stepping off. We cross time and space to serve the enemy. Incoming over Stop here. The target down. Oh, don't tell me that that wasted your like untouchable because you killed him. Did it? I was going to say, is the game bugged? Is this what I'm dealing with here today? Okay, you're down. You're going to pick up some loot too, which is Target perfect, I think. Advanced laser sight and superior conditioning. Target asset located. 
And there's the chosen action, which causes you to run away because you're annoying. Right. You can't see either of them. Yes, Bladestorm's amazing. Hmm. I can Reaper. The problem is, is I can't guarantee that you actually will die from this action. So I'm going to try. If I kill you, then I have other things to add. Get out of your psychic container. It has been so long since I have seen a sword thrust in pure hatred. You will outflank either way. On the move. So, uh, can I dual strike? That's the first question. Can you even see the target? Now that we have visual confirmation on the Chosen, you cannot see the target. Alright. You take more damage from explosives than traditional foes. Where is our Reaper? You're in shadow, you're not in overwall, you're not in true concealment. Um... Hmm. Darn, there isn't a way... There is not a way to do what you I want you to do. And your aim is just not high enough, because I would love to banish, but... I think it'd be better to just give you... How far can your grenade reach? Move up, out of cover. You'd have to move up again, meaning I'm probably going to have to waste an action to move you guys forward, but I don't know. DeLuca. You're probably the one that can get the closest. Because I just want to get a grenade on the Chosen. Oh my gosh, Thompson. Thompson! <sighs> Fine. You know what? This is move. so funny. I'm just going to try it. 41%. We can do this in a moment. So... Where is Min? Min, you're going to move up, but you're not going to do anything Finally. else. You're going to advance teamwork on your ally. You have the power. We're going to attempt to grenade the Chosen. If this grenade works, then I'm going to do a bunch of other things. The likes of which the world has never seen before. Maybe. Maybe. Depends if we kill the Chosen this turn or not. Shell-shocked biggest booms and the heaviest damage that we've ever seen. Quick question. Uh, you have an 81% chance to hit, but what I'm really concerned with is what is your percentage chance to hit now that he's exposed? Nothing, because you don't see him. You disappoint me greatly. You can't move. Thompson, you know what? For funsies, take the final shot against the Warlock. Congratulations, Thompson. Think that's it. Guess that's that, ladies and gentlemen. I am defeated today. It is but another trial in my service to the elders, and their vision foresees all outcomes. Status confirmed. Yeah, keep saying that, fish all face. Hostiles are down, and the area is secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Great job, Commander. But there's no trace of that chosen left. I've got a feeling we haven't seen the last of them. Still, at least we ruined their plan. So does this actually act as recruitment when a random soldier joins us? by local peacekeepers was a planned exercise. Citizens should not be alarmed. All weapon damage fire control, damage and control, wounds damage control. were simulated to better train advent forces. Good job, Mr. Thompson. Oh my gosh, you actually are a rookie. Tell me, I actually get to keep Mr. Thompson, because that would make me so happy. Please? This just goes to show that the Chosen are vulnerable, and we can take them down. We just have to figure out how to keep them down. DeLuca takes Salvo. Thank you. Superior conditioning for additional health beyond what is insane, and we gained a bunch of other supplies to work with.